I'm Mark Butler. I'm a product line business manager for Micromotion, the division of Emerson who makes Coriolis flow meters. And I'm here today with Dean Standiford, who is our global calibration quality engineer. We're in a locked room and uh, we're standing in the presence of a PFS 7K flow stand to talk about our ISO IEC 17025 accredited calibration system. So Dean, why is this room locked? Why is it so important? Well, this room is important because it's the gravimetric reference for all of Micromotion's TSM stands worldwide. It's locked because it is an accredited facility. They maintain a very low uncertainty value, and so we have restricted access to it. From, so only those who are qualified and trained to run this facility can come into the room. So this room then represents the heart, if you will, of our entire global accredited calibration system because everything is traceable back through this room? That's correct. This is a direct mass traceability to NIST. And so how does that mass flow calibration traceability trace back to NIST? Well, all of our meters, when we flow water through them, the water, the mass flow through the meter is directly traceable to the mass on the scale. The scales are calibrated with these reference mass weights that are traceable back to NIST. Is there any other measurement that is also traceable? We take other measurements in here as well. We measure the pressure and uh, temperature both up and downstream of the meter, and Micromotion owns its own traceable reference standards that we use to calibrate those instruments as well. How about density traceability? Density traceability is done by comparison to uh, traceable reference water that is supplied to us from VSL in the Netherlands, and we measure it with a, a reference density unit. Also kept in this room? Also kept in this room. Very good. So this is indeed the nerve central for Micromotion's global calibration traceability. And how accurate is our accreditation in this room? The primary stands in this room have a best measurement capability of 0.014%. That's pretty impressive, I think. That's very impressive. That's the so, lowest in the world. So. How does the traceability extend outward from this room? Well, all of our reference meters that are used in the TSM stands are initially calibrated here. This is an example of a reference meter that would go into a TSM stand that's currently being built. So their initial calibrations are performed here to provide that direct mass traceability to the primary stand. Additionally, all quality meters such as gold meters, interlab comparison meters, those are also calibrated here as well. Are these some of those meters over here to my left? Yes, these are the control meters that are used in this facility that stay in this facility. They've had calibrations performed on them for the, over the past seven years. Great. Well, maybe we should uh, talk a little bit about some of the other calibration facilities around the world that uh, are served by this central location. That'd be great.